we might as well make start making our way over to long again double check that my mic and my audio is working it is <coughs> right then it's gonna be a very scuffed journey when i get used to this You can see the concentration in me, can't you? Okay. So, cruise control works, which is lovely. Oh, shit, where have we got to go? I mean, may as well go cook nest, haven't we? <coughs> I think they're both the same sort of journey. So, might as well just go to cooking now. I think once I get used to the steering wheel, we'll be alright. But it's just that initial getting used to it. <coughs> For some reason, my lungs have just started to play up. and I was fine beforehand. So, I, I don't know what's going on. <laughs> oh, shite. Right, am I in the wrong area? So I have not stopped here. Yeah, that's fine. I'm, well, I don't see what what's wrong here. <coughs> it's just taking a long time to. Taking a long time to decide what it's going to do. Did not expect that that thing to be there. <coughs> why, oh why did I come to Kirkness? That was not the plan, was it, to come to Kirkness? That was a silly idea.
You can bit me as much as you want, mate. I can't. I'm learning the steering wheel, man. any need to do that overtake there mate It's going to be interesting to see how I do with this. <coughs> so I'm not expecting to do all that well because I don't, I'm not used to this at all. This, this steering wheel is completely new to me. Brake is proper sharp, isn't it? <coughs> um, <laughs> why do I feel so scared compared to normal? Very close to it in a good kilometers an hour. Can anyone tell me, does, <coughs> does ETS give feedback to these, these things, these steering wheels? If they do, that would explain why it feels heavy. <laughs> because I haven't been playing the game with gears I've never played the game with gears properly this is so surreal to be using the gears <laughs> I 
I mean, eventually I'll get to a point where I'm feeling comfy and you can tell I'm feeling comfy. Excuse me. I mean, until that moment, I'm going to look so fucking uptight. Do I get fuel here? The answer to that is, no, I'm not getting fuel here. Still getting used to having to change these gears. Someone coming towards us. Hurtling towards us. <coughs> I'll be glad when this cop suddenly stops. Came out of nowhere, honestly.
How's it going? Do me, do, do me XR. Is that how you say that? <laughs> I feel like I've just butchered your name, but welcome to the stream, man. Good to see you. We are uh, trying to learn to play with a, <clears throat> with a steering wheel at the moment. I, I've always done mouse, mouse control, but I've obviously uh, splashed out for a, for a steering wheel and yeah, <laughs> it's taken a little bit to learn, actually. A little bit more than I expected, anyway. Yeah, I'm, I mean, I'm enjoying it. I've got the Thrustmaster T... T248? <clears throat> the T248 Thrustmaster. So... Yeah, I mean... Just the stream, learning, learning how to use the uh, steering wheel for the first time. <coughs> and obviously, because I've now got a steering wheel, and I've got the flappy paddles on the back of it, um, I'm doing all my own gearing now as well. So before, I never used to do it. I never used to worry about the gears. There was no point worrying about that. Just steer with the mouse and press W to go forward. That was all I used to do. Whereas now I'm having to properly concentrate a hell of a lot more. And it's going to be interesting to see how I manage to park this. Depending on what parking it gives me. <coughs> it might give me simple. It might give me advanced. I can't remember what I've got set down. So can't you have it as random as well? I've got to remember, we've got to take a photo for the thumbnail for YouTube as well. Because obviously this is a recorded session. Uh, so, because this is a recorded session, obviously this will this will make its way onto YouTube. I don't know whether my mic's picking me up good or not. So yeah, this, this session will make its way onto YouTube, or at least this journey will. And then if we do another journey after that, that will also make it to YouTube. I record all all YouTube all for YouTube <coughs> so obviously if you if you um, if you want to check out the YouTube I think I think I've set up exclamation YouTube exclamation mark YouTube and it'll come up I think I've set that up I know I've, you're well over my side the road, mate. Look at that, I've set it up. <coughs> I had a bit of a lag there. I don't know whether that was a server or whether that was me. Yeah, on the channel we do loads of stuff. We do we do smite, we do uh, ETS. I'm, uh, now I've got the steering wheel. I'm planning on doing a lot more ETS. I also have ATS. So that will be coming onto the channel as well at some point. Which should be great. I do like ATS. But if I'm struggling with the steering wheel on ETS, I've got to get used to it before I go over to ATS. <coughs> With the ATS uh, lorries being a lot longer, it just makes sense to me to uh, make sure I learn ETS properly first. Ha <laughs> 
No, obviously I'm worried about doing race miles for the VTC. As I'm trying to learn this. Luckily the VTC isn't too concerned with race miles, but it would upset me if I uh, if I do do race miles. It would upset me massively. I don't uh, I don't like doing race miles. I like to do make sure everything's as fast as possible, but real. <coughs> so I drive for uh, Cheltenham Transport. Uh, Cheltenham's a really good really good bloke. He's not super strict on his uh, on his VTC, which is great. He's uh, quite laid back. I like it. I like the fact it's laid back. Oh, I forgot about my fuel. We uh, we have a uh, convoys every now and then. Not that often, but it's getting more often as more of us go back to ETS. <coughs> so. Yeah, it's a good place to be. His Discord's also a good place to be. I don't have my own Discord. I don't see the point when uh, I, I I spend all my time in Cheltenham's Discord, so... It just seems a little silly for me to have one. You know what I mean? So... I just love driving through Scandinavia, though. <coughs> on this game, this, this Scandinavia is so gorgeous to drive through. That was a petrol station. I just drove straight past it. That was clever. That was incredibly clever. So when's the next one? When is the next one? I have no idea. I'm assuming I'm about to be overtaken by someone as well. <coughs> obviously this man cannot drive on a steering wheel. Yeah, if you're, if you're enjoying the stream, don't forget to drop a follow. That would be very much appreciated. I'm aiming to get to 100 followers by the end of the month. That's another 20 followers. So we're nearly there. We are nearly there. <coughs> and to get to 100 would be awesome. It was sort of reaffirmed that this is what I want to be looking at doing quite a lot of. The ETS stuff. ETS, ATS, that sort of stuff. It would affirm that. And it would make the investment in the wheel worth it <laughs> as well. Obviously, these wheels are not cheap at all. I am not trying to speed up to go past you, mate. So stop you going past me. I am purely just driving. One speed. <coughs> If you want to overtake me, please do it quickly. Anyone else see this as an accident waiting to happen? This is surely an accident waiting to happen. I can't remember what my button for that light is. <coughs> I can't remember what my eye beam button is, that's good. That's brilliant. Oh no, wait, is it this? No. Oh shit. I can't remember what my high beam button is. 
<coughs> that is not great. Surely we're coming up on another petrol station soon. We've just gone past some a place post speed. If we've just gone past post speed, that must mean that we are coming up on somewhere. <coughs> or not. I don't want to slow down the bloke behind me. Which is why I'm uh, <coughs> sort of just taking them at a whim. Some fuel in. Oh. So yeah, we're driving the, the Volvo V at FH four sixty in the Cumbri Library colours. Orange, black well, orange and white I think is the library colours, but I've added a bit of I've added a bit of uh of um, black in there. Where the hell am I going? <coughs> right inside the road, Ash. You're in Europe. It's so surreal to be playing this game on uh, with a keyboard and mouse, with a steering wheel. So used to playing it with a mouse. My lungs are genuinely struggling. I don't know what's wrong with me all of a sudden. I was fine before the stream started. <coughs> and now I just need to feel like I need, like I gotta hack me guts up every few seconds. I don't know what's wrong with me. Do not know what is wrong with me at all.
We are 16 minutes away from our destination. We're getting there. We are getting there. Now that I've stepped back like that, I feel like I need to have the chair right here. <coughs> Once I get into a position where I know I'm going to be comfy, and I'm going to be able to see the screen properly, and... All that other stuff, I'll be all right. It's just working out the little kinks since having the keyboard. I might have to actually go and get me an Ayla. See if I can do these 15 minutes to the end of this, uh, <coughs> for the end of this journey. And then I might have to go and get me an Ayla and uh, inhale some medication. Got to remember to keep an eye on the sat now. Otherwise, I'm going to end up having to do a lot longer journey. I did not sleep much last night and I was up at bloody half six. So at least now it's seven o'clock at night. <coughs> Everyone loves a good horn to say hello. Oh, oh, hello. <laughs> I love it. This is what I like about this game. <coughs> I definitely need me an Ayla. Oh. <laughs> 
Right, we are coming to our exit. I fucking knew I was going to hit that. Don't way too quick. I apologise to everyone for the copy. Really do. Both on YouTube and on Twitch. Those that are live with me here now. And those that will watch this later on YouTube. My lungs seem to have given up the ghost. <laughs> right at this moment. <coughs> right when I started streaming, they've been fine all day. I'm still getting used to it, Smiler. It's uh, yeah, it's a di it's different. <laughs> it's very different. It's getting it's getting used to the fact that I'm now also doing gears. <coughs> the wheel feels really tight. And I think that's just because it's uh, new. I reckon. Or maybe it's just the fact that I'm playing ETS. <coughs> but yeah, it, it feels it feels tight, but it has this um, thing response thing to it that it can tell what game you're playing and then it adjusts how the wheel turns based on that so if you were then to drive on dirt the wheel would respond to you driving on dirt in the um so if you were playing dirt rally or something like that you'd be able to feel the difference in the wheel between concrete and dirt which i mean is pretty cool <coughs> but I can't. I don't know whether ETS holds that technology. Because if it does, that would make sense as to why the steering's really heavy. But I wouldn't. I wouldn't assume it does. Yeah, exactly. Doubt it. Yeah, I. I, I wouldn't assume it did. 
So, but the steering wheel feels really heavy. But I'm not sure what a steering wheel is supposed to feel like on a computer. <coughs> you know what I mean? I feel like I'm comparing it to a real life steering wheel. And I think I've got to remember that this is not a real life steering wheel. This is definitely a um, a gaming steering wheel. So it's not going to feel the same. But yeah, it's taken me a little bit to get used to. Also, like I said, remembering to change gears is the big thing. So I'm so used to playing with mouse and automatic gearbox that actually having to change up and down is so weird. But other than that, I'm enjoying it. <laughs> But I definitely need my inhaler, man. I'm not quite sure where it is at the moment. I'm going to have to go and quickly find it when I finish this journey. <coughs> I can't breathe at all. And also, I'm noticing roundabouts at the last minute. I'm not paying as much attention to the sat nav as I used to. And I don't know why. Maybe it's to do with the fact I'm focusing on my speed so much because I don't want to accidentally do race miles. And I've noticed a couple of times that when I'm going around a corner, I'll, I'll go to like flip me indicator <laughs> as if I'm actually driving my, my car. Like I just suddenly reverted to driving the car with it. Yeah, but if you've got a gear shifter, do you use a uh, a gear shifter? Yeah, see, I haven't got a gear shifter. I've just got the paddles. All right, if I wanted to buy the gear shifter as well, <coughs> it was going to cost me another 120-odd quid for the gear shifter for it. 
I was like, well, I'm not going to pay that at this moment. So, I passed on that. Ah, so I've got simple parking on, okay. <coughs> oh shit! Oh, I just skipped it, I think. Oh, it gave me that. Which one's button seven? That one. <coughs> All right, so there we go. First job done.